right? You're gonna see Cobalt on the left here, Vice on the right. The one big thing to point out at the very beginning of this match is that both players are playing on separate levels. So we have a level cap during the tournament. I shouldn't say cap, but like a minimum, uh, depending on your rank. And people can always opt to play higher. So Vice looking to get some of that practice in, trying to play on level eight, maybe go for a promotion at the end of this. So this should be very interesting as Vice is pretty flexible on a lot of levels, I would say. And he's definitely one of the people I usually look forward to playing against. He's a... Uh... He's definitely not, uh, in my personal opinion, he's definitely a uh, higher gold, maybe ready to get flat, and I think hopefully we'll see that here in this match. But he is getting topped off right now, and as we can see. Yeah, for sure. He's been in several intermediate uh, displays so far, and he's one, if not finished, like top two or three in quite a few of them so he's looking to make his mark with this last one here but cobalt won't be an easy opponent to top off you could say vice has quite the advantage in the state but we've seen cobalt have some pretty good performances in the past certainly and i've definitely watched a few streams of yours that show him doing pretty good So far, neither side looks to be uh, doing anything too major. Looks like they're just kind of poking each other a little. Yeah, very Small common combos beginning. and chains. Yeah, very, be uh, very common in the beginning here to see when you have like these couple rows of panels like you see on both sides, Vice with a little bit more, but it's kind of hard to get that vision to extend your chains out more and with vice probably getting adjusted to level eight here the timing is a little bit off right now too so yeah just those little pokes here and there kind of putting small pressure on and eventually as the time goes on the stacks begin to rise a little bit faster that's when you're going to see the struggle from both of the competitors come out yeah and Hopefully the, the uh, struggle won't be so major. And by Cobalt here getting topped off. In a little bit of a position there. Should be able to clean it all out though. slowly hammering a little bit more and more and cobalt will be topped off now and she's able and still to still got one row yeah but with it... the new pieces he should get topped yeah vice just hasn't had any pressure whatsoever on the screen so it's been pretty easy for him to not worry about the uh death that's coming his way but cobalt's able to deal with the pressure pretty well those shock panels, I kind of feel like uh, Cobalt had a missed opportunity there. Could have easily sent five clear on the shock panels right there, and that might have helped him get some pressure on uh, Vice. And now he's topped off with only uh, three rows of panels, but he does get clear. Yeah, finally one of the most scary spots for Cobalt, and Vice just finished off another chain here. This is going to be Pretty scary for her trying to stay alive. Gonna have this nice three chain lined up here at the bottom though. But still, yeah, heavily in Vice's favor. I believe there's gonna be more garbage dropping on enough to top yep, off Cobalt. And it looks like that topped him out. So Vice taking the first match. 
Yeah, very, very close for the most part. It was just a battle of whoever got that uh, chain and combo pressure off at the beginning. But yeah, that can happen a lot on the lower levels, especially if you're not used to the uh, quick timings of a, a new level. And yeah, Vice just managed to outplay Cobalt. And as we're heading into the second match, I want to say hi to Oren Scott in chat. And thanks for the uh, Twitch Prime sub, man. I hope you get uh, a lot of knowledge when we showcase your games later on here. I know I do. It looks like Vice is already like, all right, let's cut out this long match. I'm going to start with this immediate five chain here to put some pressure on. He's going to have quite a few panels still to work with here, so he's able to find a little bit more chains as well. This could be a much quicker match than we saw previously. But Kopo with a four chain as well. Yeah, definitely. Those, uh, ooh. Looks like he didn't have a match up at the top and he ran out of time. Yeah, then that's what level 8 will do for you. I know Vice, he, he does have quite a bit of experience on level 8, but I, I feel like since the minimum is level 6 for gold, uh, he's opted to play that level a lot more in tournaments. So even so, with all the practice on a higher level, it can get to you every once in a while. With that change from 40 health to 20 health, man, that's exactly twice or... Er, you have 20 frames instead of 40 frames to react. Furthermore, I'd also like to mention that every now and then I've seen Vice play on level 9 and even 10 and even beat me every now and then. That's really the state of this game right now, especially with the uh, level restrictions on each one. Uh, you kind of have to get used to a lot of them unless you're at that top level and elect to play 10 almost every time. But a lot of players find pride in their abilities to be able to adjust between each level going back and forth. And I will state that uh, cursor speed also plays a factor if you know you have a really slow cursor speed. Now, getting used to the uh, sudden death that you can experience when uh, having such a low health bar, it really makes a huge difference, and you really have to learn to compensate for that. Alright, it's beginning to look a lot like the uh, first game we saw here. Cobalt just a little bit uh, smaller on the pressure side heading over to Vice's. As you can see, only three rows of panels on Vice, and that garbage is just now falling. So, nowhere near close to being topped off as Cobalt's getting close to the top there, but still a little bit of wiggle room. Ooh, didn't see the horizontal yellows there, and almost a panic yeah, situation so but uh composed composed herself to find that uh other uh vertical but another scary spot there and yeah vice and is Cobalt going to take will it fall. yeah that's just vice finally putting on the pressure there at the end and that's what it seems to come down to the person who puts on the pressure the quickest usually the other person uh crumbles and uh, ends up losing this round. Especially when you start seeing those uh, larger chains get like a really good setup. You can get some really big chains and usually that will top anyone off and usually finish them. Cobalt had a good opportunity at the very beginning of this match, had like a little uh, cheesy combo when Vice had that very tall left pillar. Vice was able to get the stack down and Cobalt really didn't have an immediate follow up. But trying to build a chain off of this garbage and look at that, 6 chain falling really right into place. Chain from Cobalt, 6. Could be a but good Vice off. should be able to fire back with one of his own. He's already got five. Mm -hmm. The 
life of panel Seven. attack, man. As soon as you build a big chain, the a person can respond back with even a bigger one if they utilize the time appropriately from clearing that big garbage block. So this is where we're going to see the battle get a lot more heated now. Now Cobalt has all the opportunity to clear this big chain block. Pretty modest four chain there. We'll still have plenty of time to try to break down the rest of this garbage here. Oh no, he didn't switch the right panels. Yeah, very unfortunate there. It, it can be pretty rough when you're trying to live that very last second and you maybe just like overlook one of the clears that's immediately available to you, but. You know, that happens, and that puts Vice on game point now, looking to win our very first game of the tournament. Vice is definitely looking favored to uh, win this match, to say the least. I noticed Cobalt had a lot of uh, chains and... Uh, a couple of combos that I mentioned earlier with Shotgun is that he really could have taken advantage of, but it's not surprising. Yeah, for sure, I definitely agree with you there. You gotta take advantage of those shock blocks when they come, because, I mean, you don't really see them too much in matches, except for the ones that kind of still may go out for a while like this, but they can be very, very valuable, because it's essentially, like, I don't know how to it's describe like it. throwing a three chain or a four chain all at once. If you can get, like, a combo with the shock panels, that alone is a huge advantage. And it's, it's definitely something that you've got to watch out for, especially when you get into the higher levels, because that, that sudden row of blocks, with them being a different color, so that they can't be cleared off like regular garbage blocks can, it can really make a huge difference because your opponent won't get as many panels to use as quickly to counterattack. Cobalt here getting really lucky, not getting topped off, just barely had enough time to get those clears. Mm -hmm. And if you lay, you layer those uh, shock blocks appropriately with those small combos, as you mentioned, man, it's just like a reaction fest from that point on. If you are topped off, you have that one row that's going to clear, and if you do not react fast enough, you're probably dead and even then if it's layered appropriately it's going to continue to do that two or three times in a row so it's a constant battle of i need to find a clear as quick as possible yeah and finding that clear can often be uh can often be challenging on the ground because you don't if you don't know what you're looking for it can and the worst case scenario is when you actually don't have that clear readily available and you just get topped off. Oh my, Cobalt had one health there at the end and found that clear to extend it to and a chain. And he still fell. Yeah, sometimes even when you do find that thing last second, you're still trying to find the clear, you just eventually run out of space and that's what happened on Cobalt's end, so... Vice, the pressure Vice was just too much. Match. 